Each day, each day I play the role of someone always in control. But at night, when I go home and turn the key, there's nobody there, no one cares for me. And trying hard to find your dreams Without someone to share it with Tell me what does it mean Oh, I want to run to you Yes, God, Nessa girl, I had to call you And I didn't even call you with a song, honey I had to sing it to you To pay homage to the late, great Whitney Houston Yes, God, honey, I went down to the salon I told her, girl, give me your old nasty tribute Piece of hell, okay? I wanted her to give me some old late 80s, early 90s. How will I know? Okay, she gave me nasty volume, nasty bouffant. Let me tell you something, Nessa. If you didn't know, my hair is laid like Whitney Houston, bitch. Yes, God, hunty, okay? Girl, Nessa, like I said, I know you heard, but they say they found Whitney Houston dead to the tub, girl. Child, I was so distraught. I was on my way home from getting some dog food when they called. But that's all right, honey. Because this hair is going to pay homage to my sister. How will I know? Just trust the feeling. Yes, God. How will I know? She did this. Yes, God, honey. This is Whitney's greatest hits. Okay? Double disc. Yes, God, honey. She did this. I am paying homage, girl. Let me tell you something. Don't judge, Nessa. It's a lot of speculation going on as to what happened, but I'm going to tell you something. I, Funky Dineva, I choose to remember her not for being broke, not for being back on her way up, not for having a troubled marriage with Bobby Brown, not for having a substance abuse problem, but I choose to remember her as the legendary pop icon that she was. And that's what my auntie used to always tell me in this life. We all got our cross to bear. And perhaps this was hers. But I'm going to tell you something. Sometimes God put people through stuff in order to help other people with their lives. And I'm going to tell you something and you may not believe it. But the passing of Whitney Houston has helped me reevaluate my own sobriety. And keeping my nose clean and getting my life together with certain things that I know ain't right. That we do in the name of fun. Okay? Sometimes you can get involved with stuff, Nessa, and don't even know what you're getting, getting involved with and get in over your head. But I'm not going to go in for her. I'm going to pray for her family. I'm going to pray for sis. I'm going to pray for everybody. And we're going to remember her. But I'm going to tell you something, bitch. You better hurry up and carry your ass on iTunes and get that greatest hits, honey, before they try to charge $30. And don't goop the children, bitch. Last week, the damn CD was $9.99. Now y'all hoes trying to charge $30. Don't pull it, Miss iTunes. Okay, so you better go ahead and get that, girl. Um, the minute I found out she dead, bitch, I had went on there and got me old nasty double disc um, Whitney's Greatest Hits when she's standing with the drill like this. And I got waiting to exhale, honey, because everyone falls in love sometimes. But, girl, I'm going to tell you something you may not have known about Whitney. She helped me with Tony. She helped me through with a lot of stuff. Matter of fact, you know the song, bitch. Remember we used to um, line dance to this all the time? We used to go to the bar. We used to go down to Iguanas. You remember this. She'll help you with your man, honey. You remember this song. Listen to what she said. Things just ain't the way that they used to be. Back in the day when a man meant security. After working hard all week. Wanna sit back and throw up your feet. Let me fix you a little treat. So you might be a little bit sweet. May not be perfect, but he's all the man I need. He's ready and willing. He gives me the feeling. And whenever we're together, I know where I belong. It's just the way he looks into your heart. Love that man. Love that man. And he's always there. I know 
Yes, God, honey, we used to get old nasty line dance, but she helped me with that. She said, things ain't the way they used to be back in the day when a man meant security. Yes, God, honey, she said that because God knows Tony ain't helping me pay shit right here. Tired ass. And I said I wasn't going to catch his ass in the 2012 with me. Anyway, child, I didn't call about that. But anyway, we need to get ready. We need to write Deborah Lee, girl, and help get the tribute together so BET don't fuck this up. But, girl, let me, real quick, let me talk about these Grammys last night and how the fuck these hoes made us wait two hours and 46 minutes for this tired ass tribute. And let me tell you something else. I don't know if you peeped this last night with Miss Jennifer Hudson, by the way, which I can't stand. Ball gowns, ballots, and big hair. Jennifer Hudson, don't pull it, bitch, okay? We see you trying to poise yourself to be the next Whitney Houston, all right? You might be nickel slick, but I got your pee in the change. I sent you, and I caught you, and we ain't having it, okay, with your scarecrow-looking ass. And let me tell you something. They had Miss LL Cool J hosting them awards last night. They should have just left it with the prayer in the video because I think they would have been fine until we could have did something a bit more appropriate. But the song was for what it was. I don't know. I think it would have been nasty, honey, had they opened up with Beyonce singing old nasty, old ethereal, old nasty slow jam from Whitney Houston. Yes, God. But anyway, let's talk about what all we need to tell Deborah Lee. Deborah Lee, these is all the people who cannot be on, matter of fact, be at the tribute. Rihanna, Ashanti, Carrie Hilson, Sierra, Marsha Ambrosius. Keep all them away. Keep them away. Nicki Minaj, keep them away. Keep them out of there. Okay? Girl, we're going to have to call in the heavyweights, honey. We're going to have to bring in some old old school divas for this, honey. Y'all going to have to get Miss Nikki Gilbert from Brownstone. Yes. Find miles to empty. Call in Miss Tamia, honey. We're going to have to go get Shanice. Kelly Price. Faith going to have to audition. Because, you know, she real here to miss. Okay? Patty, no Fantasia. No God. Keep Fantasia from Ryan now. Um, get Patty. I'm trying to think who else. Ooh, Regina Bell. Go get Regina Bell. She right here in Atlanta. Go get Regina Bell. Mariah Carey. Go get Mariah Carey. Um, let me see. Go get Brandy. It's only right. Brandy could do a little How Will I Know. Or she could do, um, I Want to Dance with Somebody. Yes, God. Um, and who else? Monica might could do a ballad. No Keisha Cole. No God. No Keisha Cole. Um, Go get Don from In Vogue. Let Don do something. And matter of fact, I was going to say Coco, but let the whole SWV do something. They could do a nice medley. No Kim Burrell. No Gorillas for the tribute. No God. No Nita Baker. No Kim Burrell. Get Yolanda Adams. She could do something. Um, of course, Shaka Khan got to do I'm Every Woman. I can cast a spell. Secrets you can't tell. Yes, God, honey. I just hope Shaka push some of them titties down and realize that this is not about her and it's about Whitney and kill her all this up. Like my grandma said, kill her up. Kill her all this up, Yvette, Yvonne, whatever her name is. Um, girl, I'm trying to think. I don't know. Write all that down and I'll call you back with who else, else need to be on it. But girl, lastly, honey, did you see Housewives? Child, I flipped between them old boring ass Grammys. Oh, girl, let's talk about how these, these was the most boring ass Grammys I ever seen in the whole wide world. But let's talk about these Housewives real quick. Let me tell you something. Marlo getting on my nerve. I thought she was a nice girl, and I dug her apology and everything, but she is getting on my nerve. Hi, huh, Miss Nene. Child, I don't even want to talk about that. Anyway, now, so I'm finna get in here and uh, fix me something to eat. I'll call you a little later, girl, and keep your head up, honey. It's going to be all right. Shoot, shoot.